my name is Bert. And I'm Dora. And this is Stoner Foodie Review. <laughs> so uh, today we're going to be checking out a place called Juba uh, down in Tequila. And it is a uh, North, or sorry, it is an East African uh, cafe. Yeah. And uh, yeah. looks good. Yeah, I'm just, I've never had African food before, at least not to my knowledge. Uh, uh, I have, and yeah, I've enjoyed it, so. So I'm kind of curious to see what kind of, like, spice and flavors there are got going on there. So, Good I'm excited. Chicken sandwich. But first. We should get stoned. We should get stoned. All right, and today we're smoking, uh, we got a juicy joint going. Uh, this one's black cherry is one of my favorite flavors. My absolute favorite. I, I was really into this. I don't want to say I think this personally. These are probably one of the best, best $5 joints you can get. That's so good. I know I've said it before, but they're so good. <laughs> I love them so much. I wish we had more of them available. All right. And so... Today we're going to be trying a chicken sandwich. Yeah, um, I don't know what makes these like different than like a regular chicken sandwich. I guess we're going to find out uh, because I kind of ordered it blind, not going to lie. <laughs> um, so we'll see. Uh, whatever it's got on it, it's got. <laughs> so I didn't special order it. I didn't. <laughs> I, um, I just picked the place, so I have no clue. <laughs> Mm, but I'm getting, I'm getting hungry. So, uh, I think we should eat. All right, so we've got these uh, chicken sandwiches. Well, it's one chicken sandwich. We cut it We cut it in half, you know, for presentation. Two people. You know? uh, but this is from Juba. Uh, again, down in Taquilla. Um, so... Uh, I'm not really sure, like, what to what to say other than uh, let's fucking go for it. I guess, right? Chicken sandwich. Chicken sandwich. It looks like it has a barbecue sauce or something. Yeah, it looks like a kind of a barbecue, either either a sauce or a rub or something on there. But cheers. That's good. Oh whoa, that was not what I was expecting. Definitely a barbecue. Mm hmm. But sweeter than I thought it was going to be. Whoa. That was not what I expected. So there's lettuce, the mm -hmm. chicken, which is like really good, tender. Really flat, too. Like it mm -hmm. looks like they kind of flayed it in, and yeah. Um, looks like some kind of mustard. And then that barbecue, and that is, that is amazing. That barbecue, yeah, that's a pretty good barbecue sauce. Mmm. You know, from the looks of it, it was kind of a little wimpy looking. But that flavor... That 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 pack is a punch. Yeah, that's with a lot of flavor in a little bite. <clears throat> it's good. That is really good. Yeah, I think we should uh, smoke and reflect upon upon that, and then secretly eat it off camera. That was incredibly unexpected. Yeah, no, that was really good. It had a sweet barbecue sauce that, like, it was very complimentary with yeah. the chicken meat itself. Yeah, um, and there's definitely, um, definitely a bit of, uh, I know we got that cumin flavor in there. Yeah, that, uh, that, that was definitely something, it was either marinated or baked in a clay pot. You, you could tell from from the, the, the outside as well as the tenderness. I just can't quite tell. The bread was good too. Like, I've never had bread like that. It, 
it definitely, it definitely looked like it didn't have yeast, like it would be common. It know. was it was more spongy than a pita, but it was still it was really yeah, good. Yeah, I'd be interested. Com- it was complimentary. Yeah, if anybody knows what kind of bread that was, you know, feel free to let us know because, uh, like I said, we ordered that one pretty blind. Um, I I didn't really read the description. I just kind of wanted to be surprised by something. Um, Oh, you didn't read a description? (laughs) Yeah. (laughs) Anyway, uh, thank you guys for joining us. Make sure to uh, like, comment, and subscribe down down below, and uh, leave us a comment. Share with your friends. Share with your friends, and yeah, let us know where we should try. Um, I'd be interested to try some more uh, African food. Uh, and, that was a good first experience. Pretty much anything non-American, um, not to be unpatriotic. But um, I mean, American food too. But I mean, like, yeah, throw yeah, us. Yeah, we have we have American food all the time. So give us something special. Yeah. Anyway, 